Hey everybody, Tom Basil here, and today we're taking a look at the Dice Tower Library. Just want to show you how we have it put together here. Uh, we have a rack here where we're putting our mats hung up if you want to get a mat for a game. But we have currently about 18 shells. Now you'll notice some holes here. I'm at the Dice Tower Retreat right now, so some of these games are either being played or they've been pulled to do reviews. But what I'm doing is I'm putting the games on the different shelves. So the first shelf here is mostly, uh, I, and then the second shelf, are Ticket to Rise sized games. So you notice that most games we have one copy of, but if the game is fairly popular, or for example, like we have Champions of Midgard here, this one has all the expansions and this one's just the base game in case you want to do that. Shelf three is more of the same. The Ticket to Rise size box is my favorite size box there is. And again, you'll see most games there's just one of. Maybe if it's hot and new, like uh, Eco's there. You know, it's a hot new game. So we have two of those. And of course that might change. Look, a fourth shelf now, still with the Ticket to Ride size games in it. So you can see all these different games here. I think all games that people would like to pull out and play. You see two Cosmic Encounters again. That one has all the expansions. That's just the base game. Now we move on to the Ameritrash shelf. Uh, or whatever, you know. See Arcadia Quest. Maybe it's the Command shelf, but there's Scythe in the middle. The Dungeons and Dragons stuff. There's Zombie Side at the bottom. There's Cthulhu Wars. Then over here, more of these thematic games. Vindication, Memoir, Batman all sorts of games and you would be surprised how many of these games got played over the retreat more big box games you know we got conan and star wars the queen games there's crossfire and fireball island cross fireball island detective and nations um some more of those tickets ride size games now we come to the euro game section not really euro game but these are the size games the Uwe Rosenberg style games. You can see Caverna and at the Gates of Lo Yang and Stone Age. So that's this shelf and this shelf is the same thing. You'll notice there's a big chunk of empty space. That's where Galaxy Trucker and its expansions go. But there is a lot of these games, Sagrada and things like that. And now the games are starting to get a little more disorganized if only because these are the style games that are different sides, but you can see, look at that, all those pandemics, Catans, Centuries. So there's a lot of the different uh, games, of different styles. A few war games up here. Uh, and, you know, this different, there's Terra Mystica and its expansion. You can see some big games at the bottom, more big games at the bottom, and some of these longer style games that are hard to fit on shelves. Now we get into smaller games. So here we have a whole pile. Look at all those unlocks and all those tiny epic games, Japanese games. Then of course some big games underneath them and some more of the Ticket to Ride size games over here. Now we're starting to just kind of, I don't really know, just all different sorts of games that are all over the place. And then this shelf is currently our party game shelf, eh, ish. You know to some degree so you can see all sorts of party games at a con people want to play party games usually late at night or what have you and so we got plenty here the next two shelves are newer games in the library or some of them are older games but some of these are brand new and so you can see a whole pile of different games here for the people to play some of them have been pulled for various reasons again here it is, the games that are objectively bad shelf. We'll be filling it with hot games from Essen. And then look how big that ice cool is. <laughs> Those are normal ice cools. And then some other big games. There's Starfares of Catan and a few giant games there. And then we got TI4 um, and mega games, including Small World and Sentinels of the Multiverse and Flick 'em Up. And so that is the shelving system that we have here. This is the very end of the retreat. So just a few games still in play. 
but let's go take a look now as we slide down here so you might say hey these games are not in alphabetical order well they aren't because i want to put them in but we're going to have a book and it's going to be typed out this is just a written form but when you're looking for a game you just come in, in the book and so at dice tower east we'll have like six of these books and you can go through them and i want to play bora bora well that will be on shelf eight and so we're working on this it'll look a whole lot nicer when we're finished and there's a player one a teacher one at signs and then all of our card games go in these small boxes here so you know there's just small games in general this has mint works and mint delivery in it um the mind and mesozoic mama mia love letter batman and so when you want to play one of these games one of these small games let's say you want to play bloom you'll pull it out and you open it and then there's the stuff for the games inside so that's what we got here several of those and then we got a table here in the middle we got racks you can use and poker chips and erasable markers and candy and things but that is what the dice tower library looks like i'm tom vassal hope you can have a chance to play this library it will be at dice tower cruise next then dice tower west then dice tower east and it's only going to get better and only going to get bigger well maybe not bigger but definitely better we'll see you next time i'm tom vassal thanks for watching the dice tower thanks so much for watching another dice tower video if you enjoy our videos, subscribe to the channel for more fun, comprehensive board game coverage. Also, consider joining us at one of our events. Come to Dice Tower Retreat, a small, intimate gathering where gaming is king. Join us for Dice Tower Cruise, the largest board game cruise. Attend Dice Tower West in Las Vegas for gaming fun on the West Coast, or Dice Tower East in Orlando in sunny Florida. Dice Tower Conventions, the friendliest gaming conventions on Earth. I'm Eric Summerer, and you've been watching The Dice Tower.